Hi, my name is Mark Hecker and I work as technical advisor for cloud at IBM. Today I'm going to show you how schematic service can be used to deploy a Kubernetes service cluster in a virtual private cloud infrastructure on IBM Cloud. For the demo we use an existing virtual private cloud in short VPC infrastructure. I already have a VPC in the Frankfurt multi-zone region. This environment is distributed over the three data centers, also called zones, of the region. Schematics is IBM's as a service offering of HashiCorp's open source infrastructure as a code tool called Terraform. The first step for using the service is to create a workspace. Therefore, we need a Git repository where the Terraform template and the other related files, like the variable input file, are stored. As next step, the execution plan needs to be created. This step determines which actions have to be done to create a desired state, which is described by the template. The values of the target environment are stored in the variable file. Required are including the VPC ID, zones and the virtual machine flavor. Optionally, for instance, is the Kubernetes version. In the template itself are the resources specified, in this case the Kubernetes cluster. Afterwards, the plan can be applied to start the deployment process. After a few seconds, we can see the new cluster in the Kubernetes view of the UI. As first step, the high available master nodes will be started and configured. These master nodes are fully managed by IBM. You will not see them in your account. Then the worker nodes will be deployed and configured. In our case, these are three worker nodes distributed over the three zones. In schematics we can see that the plan was successfully applied and the environment is in desired state. With the IBM Cloud command line tool we can now configure the Kubernetes command line tool kube control to get access to the cluster. Once the config of kube control is done we can get the details of the cluster. The cluster is now ready to create resources and to deploy workloads. Schematics task can also be invoked on the IBM Cloud CLI. With the Terraform plugin for the CLI, new workspaces can be created, updated and deleted. Also tasks like plan, apply and destroy can be invoked this way. If you are interested to deploy your first Kubernetes service cluster on IBM Cloud, you can find the link to IBM Cloud and to the repository in the description below.